Evolution is the process by which hereditary traits of a species change over successive generations. Much like how no two humans are alike, every creature always has its own genetic code and therefore its own minute differences from another in its species. These tiny differences sometimes offer small survival advantages. They mean a creature may be more likely to later reproduce and pass on its genes. Every organism is essentially the result of millions of iterations of successful ancestors, which creates the tremendous diversity and optimization we see around us. To give a very basic illustration of this process, imagine a species of fish that has plenty of food, but is always being hunted by sharks. However, the environment is rich with orange coral, creating a potential refuge for the fish. Assuming biology allows it, the ones most similar in color to the coral will have a better chance of survival and passing on their genes, so over a long period of time, the species will tend to become more and more orange. On the flip side, the sharks don't need to hide from predators, so the process is a bit different. A shark's survival depends on hunting, so naturally the sharks who are better equipped to find prey will complete quests faster and gain more experience points. Once a certain threshold of XP is reached, the creature evolves to the next level and is given a few points that can be invested in different skill trees. As an example, ducks sacrifice some proficiency in swimming, flying, walking, intelligence, foraging, having hands, being able to see in front of them, and resistance to being kicked in order to be deeply invested in skill trees like buoyancy. The most competitive animals tend to invest more heavily in just one or two skill trees, however, so creatures like eagles choose almost pure flying and hunting builds while humans are deeply specced into the intelligence tree. While hybrid or tweener builds are viable, they're typically not chosen for their lack of specialization. This is evident in animals like the platypus, which are mediocre at swimming, walking, and eyesight, yet also for some reason lay eggs, have venomous spurs, and can sense electromagnetic waves. In order to moderately invest in such a diverse skill set, platypuses neglect to have other basic features like stomachs or nipples. I'm not joking, that's actually real. Evolution is generally a very slow and gradual process, but sometimes extreme natural disasters can cause mass extinctions that often bring rise to tremendous change in relatively short periods of time. Think of events like ice ages, widespread disease, volcanic eruption, and even meteor impacts. As an example, it's believed that around 66 million years ago, a meteor impact effectively blocked out the sun with debris and made a crater 180 kilometers in diameter. This event wiped out 75% of living plant and animal species on the planet and is considered one of the Earth's most controversial balance updates. Finally, while evolution is one of the most comprehensive and accepted theories in science, in a recent peer-reviewed article published in Nintendo Power, it was discovered the whole process could be completely cancelled by pressing B. Checkmate! Right, 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 right.